Hey loves, it's Mel back here again. Uh, I am super excited because I'm going to show you what's in my um, travel makeup bag. Woo -woo. Mm -hmm. Woo. So stay tuned guys. I am using the Tartan Twine um, makeup bags and this is what I use on a daily basis. I literally, this is my go-to bag for makeup while on the go. It's mostly um, lipsticks, um, perfume roll, what else do I have in there, chapstick. So I'm just gonna go right through it and show you guys what's in here. Here's my bag and I already went ahead and opened it. It's pretty messy because um, some of the makeup things have broken into it, so I already need a new one. But I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys some of the things that I have in here. Um, the first thing I'm gonna start with is my go-to smell, which is, and this is one I use on the daily, which is um, C by Giorgio Armani. Giorgio or Armani. I always mess up the name. Giorgio or uh, ah. Giorgio Armani, and it's just a um, perfume roller ball. And I literally just put it here, here, and right here, and I just kind of roll it in and do one of those. But it smells so good. Like, and you don't need much. I probably had this guy for um probably like since august and we're now in december so it's been about four months and look i've only used that much of it right there so um you know it lasts quite a quite a while and it just smells so amazing and i definitely love this scent like i, I found a bigger bottle of it and i may actually get that one for christmas for our early birthday <laughs> i don't know yet um so the other things i have in here are um my lip primer and I use the Ulta lip primer and it's already scratched off so you guys probably can't see it and I also have a um, chapstick as well so the lip primer and the chapstick pretty much in my opinion they're about the same thing but I do use the lip primer when I'm like doing a full lip um, and full makeup um, and then a chapstick I just use daily because my lips with the matte lipsticks they get really drying so it's always good to have these two in your makeup bag um, depending on the type of uh, look that I'm going for I do have the Kardashian um, lip liner this one is in gold it's like a gold color I like it because it's sort of like gold but you can make it into like a nude color if you just use it very sparingly so I keep that and I usually use this one um, in conjunction with oh, that's the reason why everything's spilling in this bag I use that one in conjunction with lipstick and it's like a nude shimmery I'm gonna swatch some of these you can't really see it but that's what it looks like very nude color in my opinion um, it's down there below use that one with this lip liner and this lip liner probably isn't the best to swatch but I'm gonna swatch it right next to it it's like a little lighter then I have some lighter colors like these are probably I should probably take these out because these are um, more for the summertime but this one here it's a really ugly way of swatching but it's also a nude which is the third one up top there um, use it with any of those colors which is really nice so if I'm looking you know going with more of a shimmery kind of pe it's more peachy and this doesn't do much justice to it it's more of a peachy color right there um, most of the ones that I showed you so far are through NYX this one is through Ulta and I haven't even done this one because it's so bright um, but it's right at the top and you can kind of let me see if I fix that a little bit right at the top there and it's very bright so these top four three or three colors I would use like during the summer or springtime um, so those are those I really love these colors at the bottom these three and that one up there um, I use those quite a bit um, when I'm going for more of a nude color so this one I'm still trying to play around with I'm gonna swatch at the top of my hand now um, this because it's like it's like a chalky like white color and this is a 
NYX lipstick. Um, I haven't really got, I don't know what to do with this because it kind of looks like, you ever seen the Chappelle show when the guy looked like he was on crack and he, <laughs> he was like scratching? That's what that color reminds me of. So I tend to blend this color like in the center of my lips um, just because it's such a, it's such a weird color by itself. Um, I don't know if it's supposed to be more of a peachy color, but I haven't gotten the hang of that using that color yet. And that's this one. It's through NYX. So it's the um, Honey Mel. Oh, this is another one that I haven't really... I've used it a couple of times, but again, it's another pink. It's very bright. Um, so I'm still trying to figure out those two up top there. And then these as well, I kind of blend during the springtime. So I should probably change these out because I use these um, during the springtime. So let's go to my go-to fall colors. My fall go-to colors I want to start with is this lip liner. Now, it's through Ulta. It's the automatic lip liner in rose. And um, I'm not really that big of a fan of it only because it's so thin. Like... I hate lip pencils that are so thin like this because what are you going to do with this? Like, look how thin that is. Like, the camera can't even pick it up. That's how thin it is. You see? So, I mean, I use it. I'm just trying to finish it up because I don't really like it. I would prefer a big, chunky lip pencil. So, that's that one. Um, and like I said before, I'm still trying to use it up so that it's just done because I can't anymore with it. Um, this is the Urban Decay Liar Lipstick. I love Urban Decay's lipstick. Like, I think I paid like 16, I'm not even going to lie, like 14 to 16 dollars for this bad boy. It was expensive, but when it's on, it's on. Like, you can't tell me nothing when this guy is on. It's right here. Let me see if I can swatch it a little bit better. There. It's this one. And it's just a really, like, you don't need much. It lasts forever. And it's just really, really good. Like, it's creamy. It's just a really creamy lipstick. And it's worth, I think it's worth every penny. Urban Decay makes really good products. Um, NYX is a store brand. But with NYX, like, you, you're basically getting what you pay for. It's, it's, NYX products are more creamy. But they also, um, they last really long. They've got really, really good colors. Um, and again, most of my most of my lipsticks are NYX because they were either on sale, um, like $2 at, at Ulta. And I'm not going to, I'm not ashamed to say that. I shop on a budget and no shame in my game, girl. Okay? <laughs> Alright, so let's continue. This one is a NYX product. I usually wear this one when I just want a lot of pop of color. I want people to pay attention to my lips and I love it. And that's a really nice dark color. Um, so I wear this one a lot. And then I also write along with it. So that's more of a red. This one below is my chocolate. Love my chocolate. The, these two, I always mix them up in my bag, but as you can see, like this one's more red, this one is more chocolatey, um, but they're beautiful beautiful colors for the winter so I wear that a lot now what I have on right now are um on the out I usually do like a lighter um inside lip color and then the outside will be like a darker um color so I'm going to start with the inside and then go out um I did not use a lip pencil although I do have one for this which I just bought from Ulta um and I think it's actually NYX NYX has a really good chunky lip pencil so um, this one is the center color, and they're really creamy too. It's by NYX. Let's see if you can see that. And then um, on the outside, I did this color. Um, it's a matte lip cream by it's by Ulta, and it's called Courageous. And again, these two colors are my go-to colors. Like, I I use this so much. And so, I'm going to swatch this one as well. Right next to it so you guys can see. And I, I love how this thing dries. It's so good. I love it. And I actually want a little lighter color. 
but you see that look at those two colors together Let's see if I can just you see like they look really good and that's what it looks like on my lips you can barely really see it sometimes my boyfriend's like do you even have anything on I mean the light may look make it look a lot lighter which I noticed in my videos because I wear it a lot like that is my go-to my favorite color is that color and so I noticed that the light makes it look a lot lighter but it's actually really really like rosy neutral kind of color and I love it so um, that is pretty much all I have guys I hope that you guys love um, the things that I've been showing you and I hope that you guys like and subscribe um, if you have any questions about my favorite lip swatches please let me know I can tell you where I got them all because um, most of them are coming from Ulta because there's usually a sale um, the Urban Decay I got from Sephora, um, and the other ones, majority of them are from Altar Sephora. So, um, like and subscribe, let me know what your favorite color is or what colors you guys are wearing for the winter. Um, if you think I should add any additional colors. I don't really like the bright, like, greens and pinks and blues and oranges. I'm not really into that, but maybe you guys can show me something different or maybe I should just get out of my comfort zone and try something new. But either way, like and subscribe. Tell me what your favorite colors are for the winter and see you in my next video. Bye loves! Whoop whoop! whoop. <laughs> Bye!